Man's arm was unexpectedly caught in the meat grinder. In such a horrifying scene, instantly startled the intern. Blood and men's meat mixed together, not to mention the intern. Anyone would surely be horrified. The doctor assured the man not to panic. They would administer painkillers and then find a way to free his arm. But the intern couldn't understand. Almost half of the arm had been crushed by the grinder. Amputation was undoubtedly the best choice. The doctor felt it made sense too. But just as he was about to arrange for the surgery, the intern suddenly stopped him again. The man's finger blood vessels were still filled. There might still be a chance to salvage it. Without further ado, they immediately needed needed to find someone to saw open a meat grinder. But Big Strong, standing nearby, was unwilling. He had spent a lot of money on the meat grinder. Opening it up would be very useless. Luckily, Chubby had some skills. He assured them he could dismantle the meat grinder. Time was of the essence, so the two of them immediately got to work. They thought it would go smoothly, but just as they were halfway through, the machine started blaring an alarm. What'd you do? I didn't do anything! As the machine loosened, the man's blood flow continued to increase, but they didn't have much time left. If they couldn't dismantle the machine within 15 minutes, the only outcome awaiting the man would be amputation. With each pass in second, the man's blood pressure kept dropping. Under the doctor's constant urging, they to quickly finish dismantling the machine. The doctor instructed them to leave immediately, because the upcoming scene would be gruesome. However, driven by curiosity, the two insisted on staying to watch. But when the arm was finally pulled out, the two were left dumbfounded. Holy God! fingers of the man were already severed by the grinder, and the thumb was mashed into a pulp. The doctor suggested replacing the thumb with a toe, but the intern adamantly refused. He insisted on amputating the man's big toe to attach it to the hand. Though it looked awkward, it would still be functional. The doctor strongly opposed this. How could they amputate someone's big toe? If they were to amputate, it should be the second toe at least. To reduce the risk of walking difficulties upon hearing this, the department head was also astonished. You guys can't even think of this method. Attaching a toe to the hand, if it were you, would you agree? Sure enough, as soon as the intern mentioned this idea, Big Strong beside him became agitated. His toe? Are you serious? Honey, calm down. I I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to yell. It's just... That's weird! Yeah. But unexpectedly, the man thought this might be a good solution. At least his hand would still be somewhat functional. He immediately urged the doctor to proceed with the surgery. I think the toe will be fine. I was right. Pulling strings behind the scenes like some kind of puppet master? While the surgery was somewhat unconventional, it did manage to save the man's palm, truly showing that there's nothing that can be done if you put your mind to it. 